Hi there, it's Jeffrey Douglas with San Diego Rover. We're out in the Anza Borrego uh, Desert today. It's really hot, about 105 degrees. Don't normally come out here this time of the year, but had a couple days extra and just decided to dash out and, and uh, camp for the night. Uh, we camped in one of our favorite locations kind of off the grid. And we did try out our newly acquired Helionox Cot Lights. And um, what I wanted to give you is just some initial thoughts. Once we've uh, used these for four or five trips, I'll do a full on review. But uh, so far, I'm pretty pleased as everything else that we own that's Helionox, it's of uh, top drawer quality, very well made, very light. Um, pretty easy to set up. It's not probably as easy to set up as the older style cots uh, that Helinox made because it's so lightweight. So it does take a little bit of effort to, um, to torque the legs uh, into the two parallel uh, rails. So the result of that is you have an extraordinarily light and compact cot. It sits uh, just a few inches off the ground and I'm a bit concerned in that I'm a little bit longer than the actual cot is, and I had considered buying the larger version, which is an enormous cot, but um, so far I think this is going to work okay. It didn't bother me that my feet uh, kind of hung over the edge a couple of inches. really wasn't a big, big deal. Uh, not as wide as I'd like it to be, but again, um, in interest of being compact and, and lightweight, I, I think it's going to be very doable. Now, last night it was, uh, even at uh, 8 or 9 o'clock at night, was still in the 90s, so it was pretty warm. Uh, if you were using these cots in the winter, you would probably want to go ahead and put on a pad between you and uh, the cot because obviously you've got some airflow that goes beneath the cot. We tried that last night with our Sea to Summit uh, pads, but it was pretty warm, so um, actually probably best if you're doing this in the summer not to, not to use a pad. And it's still, it's still relatively comfortable. Um, very lightweight, uh, packs up real nicely. Uh, like I said, what we'll do is give it a few goes and, and get some more real world uh, Feel for it and uh, give you a full review once we've uh, once we've had some time time with them. But so uh, I purchased these uh, at REI because I wasn't certain whether this would be a purchase that I would keep or not. And I love REI's return policy, but I also noticed that you can get these on Amazon. The price seems to be very compa comparable. So once again, it's Jeffrey Douglas, San Diego Rover. Please like and subscribe our videos. And I'll tell you what we're gonna do. We're gonna throw the drone up in the air and kind of show you a little bit about Pumpkin Patch. Have a wonderful day and remember, get out and explore.